All right, so in this video, I'm gonna be solving the problem two to the power of 20 minus nine. So to find the value of this for my solution, So I have two to the power of 20 minus nine. And what I'm first gonna do is rewrite two to the power of 20 as two to the power of 10 times two. And now if I have something in the form a to the power of m times n, this is equal to a to the power of m to the power of n. So two to the power of 10 times two is gonna equal two to the power of 10 to the power of two. And now nine, I'm going to re rewrite as three squared. So now I can use the property a squared minus b squared is equal to a plus b times a minus b. So in this case, a is two to the power of 10 and b is three. So I get two to the power of 10 plus three times two to the power of 10 minus three. Now, two to the power of 10 is equal to 1,024. So I get 1,024 plus three times 1,024 minus three. And 1,024 plus three is 1,027. 1,024 minus three is 1,021. Now, what most people would do from here is try to multiply like this using the normal method that everyone uses. And this is not the proper way to do it because it takes way too long. So the easier method to doing this is rewriting 1027 as 1000 plus 27 and rewriting 1021 as 1000 plus 21. So now I can distribute 1000. So I get 1000 squared plus 21 times 1000 plus 27 times 1000 plus 27 times 21. Now 1,000 squared is 1 million. 21 times 1,000 is 21,000. 27 times 1,000 is 27,000. And finally, 27 times 21 is 567. So now if I add all of these up, I get 1,048,567.